away from that just a week after the mediation committee agreed to allocate 387 billion Kenyan shillings to counties. Another storm is brewing between the National Assembly and the Council of Governors, threatening to stall the release of some 61 billion Kenyan shillings to the devolved units. In a heated debate with the mediation committee, members of the parliament threatened to ground negotiations with senators on the crucial bill. Take a look. There have been concerns by Kenyans in regards to the system and registration for sure. And what has been proposed is that our CHPs will be able to assist in ensuring that uh, people are able to register for this. One of contention here, uh, honorable chairs, if you're going to be honest with each other, is the RMLF. Now, the council from the National Assembly says, the National Assembly uh, dropped the schedule on RMLF. Now, that seems to be the automatic outcome of this mediation, because that RMLF is not available. So that takes care of the problem. That is the elephant in the room. Governors, there, is no, there should never be any fight that precipitates anyone taking the other one to court. The, the roads that are being built are built in Kenya. Community health promoters are Kenyans. So there is no contest. The amount has been mentioned in that court case. It will be uh, prejudicial to this committee and to National Assembly. And the matter I put it is so subjudice unless we don't understand anything, anything that is sub, sub, sub judies for us to go to, for us to proceed. Aya on Chuang has stated that uh, we can leave the matter of N uh, RMLF and proceed to cherry pick the other, the other additional funds. On, on contention. Putting it aside, what does that mean legally? We, we, will the report say we put aside this money 10 billion. What does that mean? What does that mean on the 10 billion? Because, you know, government is a revolving door. Government has no stores for money. So this 10 billion, what happens to it? 